video. A Medea Family Funeral stars Tyler Perry, Cassie Davis, and Patrice Lovety. And it's about Medea and her family who goes to a funeral of one of the relatives of hers. And it turns the funeral into one big giant crazy circus. Yeah, I'll just sum it up that way. Very interesting, this film. I have followed Tyler Perry's career since he came out with a diary of a mad black woman back in uh, 03 or 04. I lost track. I'm sorry about that, guys. And I've always liked the character of Medea. She was not afraid to tell you how it is. Even though she claims she's a Bible believer, she doesn't really show it that much. One thing about this character I love is that when she speaks about the Bible, she misquotes Bible scriptures. And I don't think Tyler Perry does that to be res disrespectful. It's just the type of character Medea is. Yay, though she walked in the valley with the shadow of Little Red Riding Hood and the three bears, she feared no evil because the three little pigs was not around. Amy. I don't find that offensive or anything. I, mean, I know to like some folks out there, they just go ballistic and I ain't like that. It, it's like she's trying, she tries to get a point across and then she like loses track and then replaces it with something else. It's just hilarious. But her pro whole persona on everything is just downright funny. I, I really do like this character. I think Tyler Perry was a genius thinking up of, of, this, of this character. I commend him a lot. I think by the time it got to Medea Goes to Jail, it started getting a little tiresome for me. I started noticing a trend. And my friend brought this up to me and I, I, I never really looked at it until she said something. But it's the same thing. No matter what the story is, it's like the same thing and it kind of gets a little tiresome. Now, I'm not saying that I don't like Tyler Perry's movies anymore where he plays Medea. You know what I'm saying. But uh, Medea's family funeral, it, it, was, it was actually pretty funny. I liked the characters. It was a really interesting story. You get to find out that all these dirty secrets and there's like a really big deep deep message as tyler perry puts in all of his movies there's a deep deep message by the end of this film and i i think everybody should take that to heart especially married couples i, I really did like the way this story turned out in that aspect cassie davis plays bam and now let me go on record on saying i've never seen any of the plays so i i don't i haven't really seen that much of Bam except for in the movies whenever Boo and Medea Halloween came out. That was the first one I seen where that character was in. And I thought she was pretty funny. She she adds a spice to it. And it's just hilarious that lady, if she was to get an acting gig and anything else other than this, then I think like another another comedy I think she could really light up the screen with a bunch of laughs. Patrice Lovely, which I've also seen around the same time I've seen uh, Cassie Davis's character show up. She plays Hattie. She kind of, she's like one of those awkward, quirky characters. And at first glance, you would expect that she would be the most shy, but she's actually quite talkative and she can't keep her mouth shut for nothing. Medea always has having to quiet her up, shut her up. She can't keep a secret from nothing. And But the way her character is, the way she talks, the way she moves around, I, I find her cute, kind of adorable. And it's like, I really do like that character. And there were several new characters in this. One stuck out where Tyler Perry also played. His name is Heathrow. He's in a wheelchair. He has no legs. And he talks with one of those microphones. For people that loses their voice permanently. And like most of the jokes he threw out was pretty funny. I thought that character was a nice addition. I don't think I could say that much negativity about this film. Other than the fact that like, the, okay, the jokes, a lot of them I did laugh. But some of them kind of fell flat with me. And there was one that they kept on constantly using that kind of got to me after the second act. They always reference like people. They take a long time to do funerals. You do, um, For white people, it doesn't take that long. It's just in and out. But black people, they take like uh, 40 days, 40 nights. They kept on kind of repeating that. And after a while, it kind of got annoying to me. 
But that's not ruining the film for me, though. I still liked it. That's just a minor issue I had. And, like, I know most of y'all might say, well, that's, that's not even a blip. Or, well, yeah, yeah, you may be true, but it's just how I feel. But all in all, guys, I really did enjoy this film. Sadly, I'm hearing that this is going to be Tyler Perry's last Medea role. He's not going to play Medea anymore. A lot of people are speculating that he's just taking a break. But I'm hearing that there's a bunch of people that read an interview where he was actually the Medea character. And he actually admitted that he's not wanting to play Medea anymore. And it's, it's kind of sad. I've never seen those interviews. I don't know how true that is. But I looked it up and there was like one article that stuck out and that's what it said. So it may be true. And if it is, that's a shame. And even though I said that a lot of them did get tiresome after a while, I still enjoyed watching that character. So don't get me wrong there. But guys, a Medea family funeral is worth it. I think it's really terrific. There was a really good message in there. And I think a lot of us has to take to heart because in this day and age, love and you know, relationships and marriage, you don't hear about good relationships that much nowadays. Am I saying that there's nobody out there that knows how to love? No, not at all. It's just very rare. And it's like people have forgotten that. And I think that's what this movie really tries to teach us. Don't cheat. If you're faithful, stay faithful. Stay faithful to that one person. And that's what I got in this film. And I hope a lot of other people got the same message too. Because it lays it down there really thick. And it's, I really did enjoy it. A Medea Family Funeral gets a B plus. Like I say, it was, really, it was a really good film. The characters, the score, the cinematography, the way it was shot. Tyler Perry, I think he's a real genius. And even if he's not doing Medea, I think he does a really good job. And it's just a shame to know that this is going to be Medea's final appearance. Thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. I really do appreciate it. Like, subscribe, get reputized, share. What did you think of a Medea family funeral? For those of you who have seen it, did you like it? Did you hate it? Leave me a comment down below and tell me what you think. Stay tuned for more reviews and videos coming soon. Peace the rip out.